Last stop. Lewis? I'm your Uncle Jonathan. Are you wearing a robe? It's a kimono. Here we are. Home sweet home. I found this book uh, when I was 10 years old. Um, I found it in my local elementary school library. Uh, I fell in love with it. Um, I voraciously read uh, every book in the series um, with all the adventures of Lewis and his uncle Jonathan and Mrs. Zimmerman next door. Um, and then I read everything that the author wrote, um, John Belair's. Uh, and I was just, this was my favorite author. This was my all-time favorite author. Um, he was the only celebrity, quote-unquote, that I ever wrote a fan letter to. Um, he wrote me back. Um, I still have that letter. I keep it in my desk. Do you hear the ticking, ticking, ticking? This house used to be owned by another warlock. He's very wicked, very powerful. He left a hidden clock in the walls. We don't know what it does except something horrible. I really, as a kid, still really viscerally remember connecting to Lewis. Because um, I was a nerd and an outcast and terrible at sports. And, and there were kids who were awesome at sports who were running circles around me. And, and so it was, first and foremost, it was really important to me to just capture the fact that Lewis, you know, with the greatest love and respect, was a nerd and outside the mainstream and really weird um, because that was me. And I got so much strength from Lewis growing up. Three gongs. Last time it was four. What happens when it gets down to one? Nothing good, that's for certain. The thing I'm proudest about really is the message of the movie. Um, like that there's something out there, especially in this day and age, telling kids that um, they should be weird, they should be unique. Um, not only is it okay, it's preferable. Um, and you know, I'm a dad and I have two little boys and like that's something that I want them to hear. Like, you shouldn't be ashamed for being different. You should be proud of it. Um, and the fact that I think the movie, look, it's not a message movie, it's fun, it's, but like the fact that it's got that at its core and that I think audiences are really entertained but they're still taking away that message and they're walking away saying to their kids, see, it's okay to be weird, um, is amazing to me. Have a look around. You're perfectly safe. That's safe? As long as it's fed.